How's it going, everyone? I'm back. I'm just having a doobie break, and I, I thought I'd bring up this Magic Coil little toy I built there quite a while ago. This is quite a unique machine. Not even a joke. Um, if you search my videos, it's the Magic One Wire Coil, the Magic Coil, the uh, Tesla Auto Transformer. Uh, basically, it's all one wire, right? I uh, show you how I make this thing. Um, it's the design. It's not the length of the wire or anything. It's it's the ratio. It's the way everything's divided. Anyways, I have the Magic Coil version 2.0. Once I finish all this stuff, and uh, we're going at it hard today, so we're gonna see if I can get some of these things uh, mostly together. But uh, but. You know, this, so I put 500 watts in, right? That's what this board can handle. 500 watts. 600 watts, they blow up, okay? So we know that, like, 500 watts, not throttled. If I throttled that, I could probably keep loading it, and then the bulbs will just get dimmer and dimmer and dimmer, right? But, um, anyways, uh, so 500 watts in, 3 kilowatts out AC. I don't know the DC output. But uh, AC resonance uh, for the halogen bulbs, the resistance set of, excuse me, the resonance, blah bitty, blah bitty, blah, a heater. Great. It's a 500 watt input heater with a 3 kilowatt output of heat. Excellent. Especially for Europe where they're going to freeze to death if they don't utilize that. Anyways, um, like I said, I got 2.0, but the big the big hindrance here is they don't make China doesn't make these boards bigger because they don't want anybody to figure out you know all the magic, right? But I got a workaround, right? And that's what this video is. This is taking that 500 watt input, increasing it to well, really as much as you want. You're just gonna have to do some work, and um, so. You can see this board. The first thing I do is uh, beef up these traces. In fact, I'd probably really beef them up depending what you want to do. Okay. So the cheat is these right here. I got a bunch of these. These are MOSFETs, right? You know, same same ones that are on the board, right? So I've got a couple hundred of them here. Uh, I bought them almost a year ago already. I haven't really got to playing with them yet, so. I bought them to repair all the boards that I blew up, but nah, we're just gonna soup them up. You know what I mean? Like we're gonna take that uh, two-cylinder and we're gonna turn it into a V6. <laughs> so uh, 1,500 watts on the input that increases our output to about 10 kilowatts. All right. So there's the cheat. You're gonna throw two more transistors or MOSFETs on either side the switcher you're gonna bang up your caps you're gonna throw two more caps on either side and now it's gonna do 1500 watts you're gonna want to beef everything up you may want to increase some of the resistors although they look pretty heavy duty uh, you know I'll go at it at some point when I get to it but uh, the magic coil for 10 kilowatts original the magic coil version 2.0 probably be 20 kilowatts anyways there's it that's it have a great day Ciao.